We are just minutes away from learning who won a record-breaking Mega Millions jackpot. And many people in Northeast Kansas are hoping it's them. The big jackpot would mean a big payout also for the state. KSNT News reporter Hannah Brandt is live in West Topeka to explain why. Hannah. Brooke and Jace, people have been at gas stations and convenience stores all day long buying those Mega Millions lottery tickets. And Kansas lottery officials tell me that today was so busy that at one point they were selling over $6,000 in tickets per minute. With more than $1.5 billion on the line, many people are hoping to cash in on the big payout. Kansas lottery officials even set up a drive through station to make it easier for people to buy tickets. Many of the people who stopped by say they're already thinking about what they'd do if they won. Probably get me a new car. Uh, pay off bills, get ahead, help people out. Um, probably start up a couple businesses, one being uh, probably a nonprofit. I'm a huge animal lover and probably uh, buy some land and have a bunch of animals to rescue. Kansas Lottery spokesperson Sally Lunsford says it's not just the ticket holder that would benefit from a local win. She says it would be really good for the state of Kansas as well. 45 and a quarter million dollars if we hit that mega millions jackpot. That would just be in the state income withholding taxes. So that'd be a nice little windfall for the state. And even if a Kansan doesn't win this time, the state still makes money from taxes on the ticket purchases. And that gets put back into the community as well. It's, it's definitely a win-win because even if you have a non-winning ticket, uh, you are creating money for economic development and other programs. Kansas is one of just seven states where those lottery winners are allowed to remain anonymous. And pretty much everyone I talked to today said that if they won the lottery, they'd do just that. Live in West Topeka, Hannah Brand, KSNT News. All right, Hannah, thank you very much. And I do plan to stay anonymous, just so everyone knows. <laughs> Same it's not, thing. It's not completely unheard of, though, for a Kansan to take home a jackpot. The last person from Kansas to win the Mega Millions was in 2012. The person was from Johnson County. They won $50 million, but they did choose to remain anonymous. And I think, as we can say, we can obviously understand so why. And that's a pretty major accomplishment, though, because according to statistics, the chance of winning a prize this big is more than one in a million. In fact, research shows the odds of hitting the jackpot are actually more than one in 300 million. That surpasses your odds of getting struck by lightning or getting attacked by a shark. Lottery officials say the low odds encourage people to buy more tickets, when in turn, drives up the jackpot. Now, once the winning numbers are chosen, we'll give you those to you a little bit later on in the show. You better believe we'll be watching those. Now, the show, um, you can also keep your eye on KSMT.com and our mobile app. We'll also be posting the numbers there.